Penal Code Section 39.02, Abuse of an Official Capacity. Statutory provision. A public servant commits an offense if with intent to obtain a benefit or with intent to harm or defraud another, he intentionally or knowingly violates the law relating to public servant office or employment or misuses government property, services, personnel, or any other thing of value belonging to the government that has come into the public servant's custody or possession by virtue of the public servant's office or employment. An offense under subsection A1 is a class A misdemeanor. An offense under subsection A2 is a class C misdemeanor if the value of the use of the thing misused is less than $20. A class B misdemeanor if the value of the use, you're laughing, of the thing misused is $20 or more but less than $500. A class A misdemeanor if the value of the use of the thing misused is $500 or more but less than $1,500. A state jail felony if the value of the use of the thing misused is $1,500 or more but less than $20,000. A felony of the third degree if the value of the use of the thing misused is $20,000 or more but less than $100,000. A felony of the second degree if the value of the use of the thing misused is $100,000 or more but less than $200,000. Or a felony of the first degree if the value of the use of the thing misused is $200,000 or more. There's no way any of that is going to be on a test. A discount or award given for travel, such as frequent flyer miles, rental car or hotel discounts, or food coupons, are not things of value belonging to the government for purposes of this section due to the administrative difficulty and cost involved in recapturing the discount or award for the governmental entity. If separate transactions that violate subsection A2 are conducted pursuant to one scheme or continuing course of conduct, the conduct may be constituted as one offense and the value of the use of the things misused in the transactions may be aggregated in determining the classification of the offense. The value of the use of thing of value misused under subsection A2 may not exceed the fair market value of the thing at the time of the offense or if the fair market value of the thing cannot be ascertained, the cost of replacing the thing within a reasonable amount of time after the offense. Elements, the person is a, sub, is a public servant uh, with intent to obtain benefit or harm or defraud another. Violates a law relating to office or employment or misuses governmental property, services or personnel or any other thing of value. Ranges from a class C misdemeanor to a first degree felony based on the value of the thing misused. And exceptions, a discount or award given for travel, such as frequent flyer miles, rental car or hotel discounts, or food coupons. Penal Code Section 39.03, Official Oppression. I'm oppressed. Mm. Statutory Provision. A public servant acting under color of his office or employment commits an offense if he intentionally subjects another to mistreatment or to arrest, detention, search, seizure, disposition, assessment, or lien that he knows is unlawful, intentionally denies or impedes another in the exercise or enjoyment of any right, privilege, power, or immunity, knowing his conduct is unlawful, or intentionally subjects another to sexual harassment. For purposes of this section, a public servant acts under the color of his office or employment if he acts or purports to act in an official capacity or takes advantage of such actual or purported capacity. In this section, sexual harassment means unwelcome sexual advances, requests for sexual favors, and other verbal or physical conduct of a sexual nature, submission to which is made a term or condition of a person's exercise or enjoyment of any right, privilege, power, or immunity, either explicitly or implicitly. An offense under this section is a Class A misdemeanor, except that an offense is a felony of the third degree 
if the public servant acted with the intent to impair the accuracy of data reported to the Texas Education Agency through the Public Education Information Management System, PIMS, described by Section 42.006 Education Code under a law requiring that reporting. Elements. Under color of office, a public servant intentionally subjects another to unlawful mistreatment, arrest, detention, seizure, search, seizure, dispossession, or an unlawful assessment or lien, intentionally and unlawfully denies or impedes rights, privileges, powers, or immunities of another, intentionally subjects another to sexual harassment, Class A misdemeanor. Penal Code, Section 3906, Misuse of Official Information. Statutory provision, section 39.06, misuse of official information. A public service commits an offense if, in reliance on information to which he has, exe has access by virtue of his office or employment and that has not been made public, he acquires or aids another to acquire a pecuni pecuniary interest in any property transaction or enterprise that may be affected by the information speculates or aids another to speculate on the basis of the information or, as a public servant, including as a principal of a school, coerces another into suppressing or failing to report that information to a law enforcement agency. A public servant commits an offense if, with the intent to obtain a benefit or with intent to harm or defraud another, he discloses or uses information for non-governmental purposes that he has access to by means of his office or employment and has not been made public. A person commits an offense if, with intent to obtain a benefit or intent to harm or defraud another, he solicits or receives from a public servant information that the public servant has access to by means of his office or employment and has not been made public. In this section, information that has not been made public means any information to which the public does not generally have access and that is prohibited from disclosure under Texas Governmental Code, Chapter 552, except as provided by subsection F, an offense under this section is a felony or of the third degree. An offense under subsection A3 is a Class 3 misdemeanor. Elements. Relying on information that has not been made public, to which a person has access by virtue of his office, the person acquires or aids another in acquiring an interest in property affected by the information, speculates or aids another I thought you had fallen asleep. in speculating on the basis of the information, coerces another into suppressing or failing to report information to a law enforcement agency, or discloses or uses the information for a non-governmental purpose with intent to gain a benefit or harm or defraud another. Information that has not been made public means any information to which the public does not generally have access and that is prohibited from disclosure under the Public Information Act, Texas Government Code, Chapter 552. Generally, a third-degree felony, except for law enforcement reporting, if time permits. <clears throat> That's the end of that. Praise be to the Lord.